top. This is when you get to like the very top of the trail. This is Griffith Observatory if you've never seen it before. It is so beautiful. I love going in there. I don't think it's open yet. Um, and this is, oh my goodness, this is something in my eye. This is, ooh. Oh my goodness, hold on y'all. All right. This is like a beautiful monument statue situation of the astronomers like Newton and Galileo and Copernicus. And this is where you see the Hollywood sign. Maybe I'll walk over there and show you all. And I just love coming to this trail whenever I wanna get like a quick outdoor moment. It takes like maybe an hour of my time. Um, and I love coming here early in the morning when there's like not that many people, especially during the week. In the weekends, there's definitely people here in the morning. Um, but like, you know, stretching here, meditating, looking at like the beautiful views that are literally all around the observatory. You'll see like these beautiful LA neighborhoods and just like expressing gratitude for myself living here. I remember just like always um really wanting to good morning <laughs> um i remember just like for years you know like praying um to live here and now i do and i'm just like so grateful so every time i come in here and i look at the views i'm like oh my god girl like you did it you did it girl um yeah literally always practicing gratitude and there is something that has been on my heart and my mind that i've been wanting to tell you all and like publish on my channel i know i don't look like all prepped for camera i have like a zit right here but i don't care because this is something that i really want to tell you all um i think there's some bees in these like bushes right here but i think they're gonna leave me alone because i'm being respectful and set my phone down here so i can properly talk to you all I'm gonna try to make this quick because I'm still getting used to talking in front of my phone and the camera while being around people. But this is LA, I feel like everyone's used to it. Anyways, y'all, I just wanna say, if you have been putting in effort, if you have been trying to better your life, to better yourself in any way, shape or form, I just wanna say that I am sincerely so proud of you. And I really just wanna, acknowledge your efforts and i want you to acknowledge your efforts so if you are watching this if you stumbled upon this video if you align with this video then this video is probably meant for you to watch and listen to um so get settled sit down right now and really be present with me so you can hear me out i am so proud of you I am so proud of you for trying to better yourself. I am so proud of you for silencing or trying to silence outside noise so you can really focus on yourself and your goals. I am so proud of you, even if you don't know exactly what your goals out are, but you're trying to figure that out. I'm so proud of you for trying to heal from cycles that aren't serving you trying to heal from thoughts from patterns from relationships from traumas i am so proud of you for continuing to try even if you're not seeing instant results or even if it's been a while and you're still not really seeing the results that you want to see but you're still trying i am so proud of you and if no one has told you that they're proud of you please accept this from me. And I know that some of you are like, girl, you don't even know who I am. I don't need to know exactly who you are or what it is that you're up to, or what it is that you're trying to do, you know, as long as it's with good intention. If you're out here trying to do bad, then that's not, you know, what I'm trying to be proud of. But I don't need to know exactly who you are to feel proud of you. You are a part of my human family and I just feel like there's so many people right now, especially after, you know, the year that we had in 2020 that are just going through so, still so many life changes that are going, good morning, um, that are 
still going through so many transitions and transformations and are still trying to figure life out and you know I feel like so many of us are still even healing from last year still figuring out how last year really impacted us and yet here we are still persevering still trying our best and you know sometimes our best isn't going to be the best that we know we can do but in this moment is all that we can do and i want you to feel satisfied with that be proud of your efforts be proud of trying your best even if today just your best is like actually nourishing yourself and having three meals and resting even if you even if your best is just like sending one pitch sending that one email even if your best is just drafting up a conversation that you want to send to somebody that's been hard for you to articulate i am so proud of you like i'm always telling this to like friends and to my podcast interviewees and to just the people around me on my socials like i always want to stress how proud we should feel of ourselves simply for our efforts because you know how many people there are out there that like aren't even trying and like no shade to them you know like they're we we're we're all valid in our ways of being um when it comes to you know like our own circumstances and situations and things that we're healing from a lot of us especially like the older generations don't have the same resources that us younger generations have when it comes to healing but I just like always want to stress us feeling proud of ourselves for our efforts so if you're watching this and you have been trying to better yourself in any way shape or form I just want to say I'm so proud of you and I also want to thank you for trying because it's not easy you know sometimes we try and we try and we try and like we don't see the results that we want until you know who knows how long sometimes we try and we put in effort for something and we dream it up and then we don't get the end result that we expected sometimes we try and our efforts don't go unno go unnoticed sometimes we try and we feel like it's not enough sometimes we try and it feels like it's not getting us anywhere but I just want to hold space for our efforts right now in this moment so if you're watching this please sit down please sit down be here right now and I want you to close your eyes and let's just take a deep breath together so that we get on the same breath and really be present in this moment because I, I genuinely really want you to hear this and feel this and feel me so put your hand over your heart let's take a deep inhale pause at the top and exhale one more ready deep inhale and exhale okay now that i have your full presence and attention and by the way i just want to express gratitude for you bringing me into your present moment but i really want you to hear me when i say this even though i've been saying this i am so proud of you and i want you to feel proud of yourself right now in this moment i want you to think about all the efforts that you have been putting in whether it was just yesterday or a few days ago or for the past few months or the past few years i want you to think about all the efforts that you've been putting in and i want you to genuinely acknowledge them and hold space for them right now And as you're thinking about all the things that you've been trying to do, all the ways that you've been trying to better yourself, I want you to thank yourself and express gratitude for yourself for trying. 
Thank you, self, for believing in yourself. Thank you, self, for trying to better yourself. Thank you, self, for loving me so much that you are trying, that you are putting in effort. Thank you, self, for loving me enough to try, to put in effort. Even after everything that you've been through, here you are still trying. Look at you. Look at you still trying after everything that you've been through. And again, especially after the year that we had in 2020, like we have all the reason to like not even be trying right now. We have all the reason to like be completely wiped out and just not try. But here we are, look how resilient we are. Look how resilient you are, trying, putting in effort, believing in yourself. And even though you might be watching this and you're like, I actually don't really believe in myself. I actually don't really love myself. No, like if you are putting in effort, if you are trying, that is an expression of self-love. That is an expression of self-confidence. Even if it's not the love or confidence that you think love and confidence looks like putting in effort and trying is an expression of love and confidence and self-belief and i just really i don't know this has been on my heart for a while because again i feel like there's so many people who have been putting in effort to better themselves who have been trying to change who have been confronting their shadows who have been introduced into their spiritual journey into their spiritual awakening and are trying to navigate that there are people who are um just really trying to figure things out you know so many life changes and transitions and transformation it's like we're trying to figure out who this new version of ourselves is we're trying to figure out what kind of person we want to be stepping into some of us have had to completely start over in our careers, in our relationships, in our surroundings, in our environments, in the cities, in the homes that we live in. So I really just wanted to dedicate a video to you acknowledging your efforts, you feeling proud of yourself, and you genuinely hearing it from somebody who sincerely, wholeheartedly feels proud of you and thanks you for putting in effort. Again, I don't know, I don't need to know exactly who you are because I feel you. Right now, we are exchanging energy in this moment and I can feel you watching this. Those of you who are watching this and are meant to listen to this message and align to this video for a reason, I am feeling you watching this right now. And I am expressing my gratitude to you I am expressing that I see you, that I feel you, and I am so, so, so proud of you, and I want you to keep going, I want you to keep believing in yourself, and I want you to keep acknowledging your efforts, I want you to keep holding space for yourself, if you can do it daily, at the end of every day, at the beginning of every day, in the middle of the day, stop what you're doing and be like, girl, I see you trying. Boy, I see you trying. Self, I see you trying today. Thank you. Thank you for cooking this meal for me. Thank you for talking to that one person and having that difficult conversation. Thank you for sending that one email that you have been procrastinating on sending for a while for whatever reason. Thank you for just every single effort. Thank yourself acknowledge all the efforts that you are putting in because sometimes we can get so caught up you know we can get so caught up on just doing and efforting and efforting that we don't stop to acknowledge just everything that we've been doing so i can go on i can keep talking about this i didn't want to make this a super long video i just again really wanted to hold space for those of you who have been putting in effort who have been trying and who maybe have not heard from somebody that they're proud of you I am honored to be that person to tell you I'm proud of you and I hope that you genuinely, genuinely, sincerely feel the pride that I have from you. I know it might not hit the same as maybe a family member or someone that you love, but I hope that it still hits in some way, shape or form. 
I love you. I am so proud of you. I, I really encourage you to keep going, to keep believing in yourself because I promise you that everything that is done with good intention, with pure intentions, with passion, with heart, with self-belief, with confidence, is always going to be rewarded. Your efforts are not unnoticed by the divine because the divine is energy and energy is always felt. So if you have been putting in effort, that energy of your effort, the energy of your good intentions are felt by your angels, ancestors, spirit guides, whatever higher power it is that you believe in, God, source, universe, feels you, sees you, and is already making its power moves to assist you. Even if it's taking longer than you want it to, trust the process, trust your process, trust your path, and seek out the lessons in every single day, in every single moment. I'm coming to believe that the most important thing in life, or one of the most important things in life, there's more noises now, I'm almost done, but one of the most important things in life is to sincerely just acknowledge what our lessons are and to learn them. And our lessons are, I love hearing people sing. Um, our lessons are always trying to make themselves known to us. And it is learning our lessons, acknowledging our lessons that are gonna help us step into new cycles, that are gonna help us ascend, that are gonna help us really step into this new, higher version of ourselves. So again, be proud of yourself, acknowledge your efforts, come back to this video whenever you need someone to tell you that they're proud of you sincerely. Like if I was with you and you are my friend and someone that I love and you are a part of my human family, let me emphasize that again. And you needed to hear I am proud of you like more than once a day, I would proudly do that. So here's this video to you whenever you need to hear it and i hope that those of you who needed to align with this video with this message align with this and yeah thank you so much for being here and i'll see you in my next video i just really had to share this i love you I'm so proud of you. I'm so excited for all the goodness that you are bringing into this world. I'm so excited to see this new version of you. Um, if you want to share whatever it is that you're working on, whatever it is that you've been trying to do in the comments, I would love, love, love to hear that, to read it, and to uplift you. I will see you in my next video. Love you all. Have the most beautiful rest of your evening, morning, night, day, whenever it is that you're watching this. <sighs> okay, maybe I'll show you the Hollywood sign really quick. All right, bye y'all, love you.